The internet is a wild place. People will often do and say things that they would never in real life because the consequences seem so much lighter when you can't be called out to your face. With this in mind, it's unfortunately not surprising that art theft is quite common. And if you post your art online, the chances are high that you will deal with someone reposting your work as their own or tracing it. I've dealt with this, and I've seen other people deal with this, and I found that some methods of dealing with it work out better than others. Before doing anything, it's important to consider what kind of person this is and how they relate to you. I found that most of the time, the people who steal and trace art online are young kids. If the person who stole your work is clearly young, it's important to consider that when responding to them. Also, a person who steals or traces your work because they look up to you and admire you will respond very differently to you calling them out than a person who stumbled across an individual piece of yours and liked it, but doesn't really know who you are. Let's begin with what not to do. 1. Don't insult them or speak aggressively. For example, writing, <clears throat> This is my art, you idiot. Being bad at art doesn't give you an excuse to steal from actual artists. <laughs> Please don't say anything remotely like this. Being mean will only make the person defensive, and might even make them feel more justified. Two, in most cases, don't send your friends and followers after them. Sure, this will help get the attention of the thief and people seeing their post of your stolen work, but you have no control over the hurtful things your people might say to them. They're going to feel attacked and, once again, get defensive. This may get them to delete their post, but in their mind, you're in the wrong and they are the victim. Ideally, they need to realize that they shouldn't steal because it's morally wrong, not out of fear of being bombarded with harsh messages. Now, onto what you should do. One, you should be firm, calm, and professional. You can tell them that what they've done is hurtful, and ask politely for them to either take down their post or give credit. Remind them that despite it being really easy to claim a work of art online is yours, it's just as immoral and consequential as stealing from someone in person. Directing towards where you have the stolen work posted will help prevent them from denying it. If you take this approach and give them the option to make amends by removing or deleting the post, and especially if you are a person they respect and admire, this may be the end of it. If they still ignore you, delete your comments or talk back, you can try number two, report the post if you can, and number three, like your own comment. It sounds silly and petty, but trust me on this. If they deleted your comment, send the same one again, and if the platform keeps likes anonymous like YouTube does, using any other accounts you have to like your comment will prevent it from getting buried and no one else seeing it. If they see you are persistent and are afraid their followers will notice you, they might give it up. And if they block you, you could use another account. It really depends though on what lengths you're willing to go to. This may be the point where you could enlist the help of people you trust, so long as they know to keep calm and professional. In the end, there's really only so much you can do and it's frustrating. Sometimes you just have to let it go and hope your report goes through. If you aren't already doing this, including a watermark in your posted art can help prevent future theft. When someone reposts your work as their own, you can point out the watermark. If you've dealt with art theft before, let me know in the comments what helped or didn't help you solve the issue. I'd love to know.